Hello everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel. This video is about flying the PW5 using the GoPro GPS data from a Hero 7 camera. Normally I'd use the GPS data that came from my OD2 or my Nano 3 flight computer. But you can actually use GoPro's GPS data on cameras from Hero 5 and up. You'll also need Dashware.net software, and that's free from GoPro. You can download it right away, not a problem. In the description of my YouTube video, take a look at some of the additional links of websites that you need to kind of help put this video together for you. This wasn't a soaring day, so to speak, so I just really wanted to test the camera using the built-in GPS data that you can turn on with your camera. And it's uh, surprisingly very accurate, as you can see here. Regarding your video editing suite, I highly recommend CyberLink, PowerDirector 17 and up. Really a great program to edit your videos. Of all of them I've tried, this, this one is the best and easiest to use by far. One thing I've experienced is, on your camera or other uh, data from flight computers is, the altitude can be off a little bit. I mean, 100 feet, maybe 150 maybe, but I mean, it's just just a visualization that we're really trying to use here. It's fairly close, but sometimes I've noticed when I'm landing, it's 100 feet off. So you might think that on my downwind approach, I'm, I'm, I'm low, but I'm really not. And another issue I hear all the time from pilots is uh, turning in a skid and you got to realize my camera's on the right hand side so it's going to look further off to the left than it really is so it's exaggerated even when I'm on base with wings level you'll think he's in a skid there and it's actually just uh, a normal situation but um, please I've heard enough comments about it try it yourself and uh, see what the results are Okay, now we're turning uh, base to final. Everything's looking real good. Speed's just about right. So putting these videos together, obviously you gotta use a video editing software and some other programs to get the data from the GPS uh, camera or flight computer. I mean, it, nothing's easy in this process, but with practice, it really is not that difficult. So if you look at my description on the YouTube video, I have various links to websites that you'll need to put one of these uh, videos together using the uh, display that you see now. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video and be sure and look up all my other videos on flying high performance gliders, ultralights, model rocketry, NASA, and a lot more. So you guys have a great day and we'll see you in there next time. Bye bye.